Hello everyone, Siri Emerald here, and this is about the Hot Toys Marvel Iron Man Mark 7 Sub-Zero. Now the chocolate company was given their 10th anniversary Mark 7, a white chocolate, and of course all of us out here uh, wanted our own. Thank goodness Hot Toys complied. Now it's kind of like the chocolate that they came last year that turned into the Mark 7 self. The white chocolate is now the Sub-Zero. Now this is not a screen scene armor. This isn't even screen mentioned armor. and some people will say they're milking it. They haven't sold out on this yet. It's still available for sale. It's only available at um, Hot Toy exclusive distributors. It is a pretty cool figure though. It has the carbon fiber like mesh markings on the biceps and on the calves. It's got little uh, arctic notations, little micro printing all over it. And what I also like about this is it kind of reminds me of one that Dandy Bird made uh, for Hot Toys a year or so ago called The Piano where it's black and white. What's nice about this is if you have the stealth and you have the Sub-Zero, you can kind of make your own piano. I think it's a pretty cool little figure. Uh, now, so this is MMS 329, and it has um, comes with all the regular stuff that the Mark 7 comes with. One pair of interchangeable forearm rockets, one pair of interchangeable wrist guards for posing with repulsor firing hands, three pairs of interchangeable hands, including one pair with movable fingers and light-up repulsors, one pair of fists, one pair of repulsor firing hands with light-up function, and two sets of interchangeable shoulder armors, normal and uh, missile styles. There's 30 points of articulation, it's about 30 centimeters tall, and it does come with this uh, square-ish or diamond-shaped uh, figure stand, similar to what like the stealth came with and the Mark III Stealth, and some of the other figures have come with that wing. And it says Avengers series on it. Now, release date is Q3, Q4, 2016. I anticipate it to be out around October, because, again, that's when the 10th anniversary of the Chocolate Company is, and that's when they'll be uh, releasing their Mark VII white chocolate version. And, of course, these are the prototype figures here uh, in these pictures. So, thanks for watching, everyone. Tell me what you think of this figure. Will you be picking it up, or will you be passing on it? Even though it is a repaint, it is a pretty cool-looking figure. Follow me on Facebook at Siri.Emerald and at Twitter at Siri Emerald. If you like what you see, you can subscribe to me on Patreon. Every little bit helps. Follow me on Pinterest and Instagram. Share this video and click the thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe to see more of my videos. And thanks again for watching, everyone. Happy collecting.